Every day, thousands of people drive around the city of Mobile. That's right. We have a live look to show you of Government Street in downtown. Not too busy right now, but a greater police presence this weekend show many drivers in Mobile are taking a risk. As News 5's Tiffany McCall reports, more people driving in the city are getting caught for breaking the mandatory insurance law. 1,081. That's the number of traffic tickets Mobile Police say they dished out over the three-day Labor Day weekend. This was a very busy, active weekend. Although 35% of those tickets were for speeding, Mobile Police say their biggest offense deals with insurance. Usually the uninsured motorists is, is probably the highest number of tickets that we write in any given time. So it is, it's an alarming number, but it's, it's definitely the thing that we see the most. 25% of the tickets served this weekend were for no auto insurance. Mike Wetzel has been selling cars for the last seven years. He's noticed more people taking a chance when it comes to insurance coverage. About 40% of the people come through usually don't have car insurance. I really think that the uh, downturn in the economy has, has made it really tight for people. So, you know, that's, that's a bill that is quicker for them to eliminate. According to the Consumer Federation of America, 22% of people making twenty-five dollars to $50,000 a year don't pay car insurance. That person not having car insurance costs us more on our uh, insurance premiums, but also you have the out-of-pocket costs, the out-of-work costs, and everything because somebody just did not have insurance. A liability that could surely be avoided. In Mobile, Tiffany McCall, News 5. Showing proof of insurance will be changing in the next few months. Starting January, a stricter law will make it possible for law enforcement to check insurance coverage in real time, not just looking at the insurance card or paper. 